Our first division in this year's March Mammal Madness is all about the spring and the leap and the pounce. It's time for the jump jump division! How high? Real high, apparently. I am MC Marmot, and this is March Mammal Madness! Wiggity wiggity whack! early rounds, the higher seeded contenders get home field advantage. As a result, the streaked Tenric suddenly found itself high on a mountain ledge, far from its home in the rainforest. A marker, foraging for food, was curious about this new arrival, and approached to give it a good sniff. The tiny Tenric was outraged, and jumped at the marker's face driving its spines into its nose. The marker sneezed all over the Tenric, but the Tenric stood its ground and leapt again at the marker. The marker leapt as well, away from the Tenric and away from the battle. The snot-covered Tenric is the winner! Hooray! And also, ugh. Strong, valiant, and powerful! You may remember the ringtail from 2017's March Mammal Madness. Well, it is back and was ready to avenge its previous loss. However, it found itself matched up against a Bengal tiger. As it watched the tiger leap upon a hog deer, the ringtail considered its options and its odds, and it wisely decided to scamper away. The Bengal tiger! Is the winner! For this battle, we go to one of our roving rodent reporters. Take it away! Thanks, MC! Let's hear it for the Spinifex Hopping Mouse, also known as the Tuckerwara. Normally, it spends its days hopping around the Australian shrublands. But today, a flash flood has swept our mouse out to sea on a tiny raft of vegetation. It had visions of sailing the ocean blue, but it came across a pod of spinner dolphins. The dolphins were leaping and frolicking and splashing, and then they swam over to meet the mouse, and the mouse slipped and... Well, we can't swim in the ocean very well. Farewell, brave Takawara. The spinner dolphin is the winner. Our next battle took place in the Serengeti National Park of Tanzania. The Clipspringer crept down from the rocks to forage and found itself near an impala. Clipspringers are cute, but nervous, and it stayed on high alert while it ate. Suddenly, a terrible noise disturbed the peaceful scene. The Clipspringer leapt up in fright to see the Impala locking horns with an arrival male. The Clipspringer bounded off the field in a panic, leaving the Impala victorious. Did you know that the spring hare is a rodent? It's true! More from our roving rodent reporter. Thanks, MC! I am reporting from Kruger National Park in South Africa, where an amazing battle just took place. It started when a male spring hare spotted an attractive female spring hare. But then he also noticed a nearby stranger, and it was getting a little too close. The jackrabbit also known as the Mysterious Stranger, looked up, and he looked up just in time to see the spring hare launching himself at him. The jackrabbit jumped up and said, put up your dukes, buddy. I gotta admit, the jackrabbit got some good punches in, 
But the spring hare sprang up and landed feet first on the jackrabbit, and it crushed him. The spring hare wins. Woo! The stoat is a March Mammal Madness favorite. It has even inspired its own measurement scale. Our brave stoat, weighing in at one stoat, found itself in the Himalayas looking for a snack. It spied a pika, pika! and prepared to pounce. But suddenly, a herd of barrel appeared. One barrel weighs about 300 stoats. The stoat, not wanting to be trampled, ran off. The barrel wins without even realizing there was a battle. The armadillo found itself in an unfamiliar forest with unfamiliar but tasty insects and trundled along happily. A Sifeka bounded along through the treetops but misjudged a leap and landed near the ground, near the armadillo. Was this armadillo a fossa in disguise? Autobots, roll out! Suddenly, a hawk attacked this distracted Sifeka and sent it plummeting to the ground. The armadillo wins without even noticing the drama taking place above its very head. Swing! In South Africa, a serval was watching and waiting to pounce on small rodents, which make up most of its diet. By the way, we highly disapprove of this. Anyway, the serval heard a stirring behind it and pounced. But it wasn't a rodent, it was a rock wallaby. The wallaby was not amused and sprang into the air to kick back. The serval fled in fear. Ha! The rock wallaby is the winner. That was a hoot! And there you have it, a knight filled with drama, upsets, and obliviousness. Join us tomorrow for the first round of the Waterfalls Division. This is MC Marmot, signing off. Wiggity wiggity whack!